Hey Scrabble fans, Will here with another episode of Better Know a Letter. Today, we're going to get to know the F. There are two Fs in the set, and they're worth a solid four points apiece. For this reason, the F has the most in common with the other tiles in the heavy category. Unfortunately, like the rest of the four point tiles, the F performs poorly as a bingo tile. Only 9.5% of 7 and 8 letter words contain an F. Part of the reason for this low percentage is that the F doesn't mesh well at all with its high point brethren. Notice the trend in this graph of the tiles that appear less frequently than usual alongside an F. The list is populated entirely by 3 and 4 point tiles. The P tops the list with especially poor synergy. On the other hand, the F has a strong affinity for the L and the R. If you're holding the F along with a good mix of vowels and low point consonants that include the L or R, your chances of having a bingo available will be much improved. But look at which consonant appears next on the list. Yes, you're reading that right. It's the F appearing on its own list. If you've watched the rest of the videos in this series, this will be a surprise. Again, 9.5% of all bingos contain at least one F. But within that group of words, 13% of F bingos contain both Fs. The F is the only letter in the game of Scrabble that exhibits a percentage increase in this manner. And this is true for shorter words too, which are much likelier to play with two Fs than bingos. Typically, duplicated tiles are a danger to be avoided whenever possible, but in the case of the F, duplication may sometimes be an asset. Two Fs together score an impressive eight points, which starts to hit extremely hard in tandem with bonus squares on the board. Still, while this is a really cool feature of the F, drawing two of them together is extremely rare, so this tendency doesn't add a great deal of value on a game-to-game -game basis. You're much, much likelier to play one F at a time. The F's solid representation in two-letter words will greatly help you achieve that goal. Use these two-letter F words to find space on the board for overlapping plays, especially plays where the F hits a triple letter or triple word score. Shorter words containing an F display very similar tile synergy to longer words. The F continues to mesh poorly with high point tiles, and once again, the L and R top the list of consonants that mesh well with the F. Because there are so few of them, learning words containing the F and other high point tiles will be a huge help for you to escape clunky racks with too many heavy tiles. Here are a few words that will come in especially handy for this purpose. As a heavy tile worth four points, the F has a tendency to become the focus of racks where it appears. But the F exhibits a trend that goes even further than that that you need to know about. It strongly prefers to be the first letter of the words in which it appears. This applies to both bingo length words and short words containing the F. In bingos, the F appears as the first letter roughly 40% of the time, highest of any letter aside from the J. In shorter words, those percentages increase even more. The F is the first letter of three to five letter words in which it appears approximately 60% of the time. When you're looking to play the F as part of either a long or a short word, start by trying to find words with the F as the first letter. You're likelier to be successful. Okay, let's recap what we've learned about the F. There's no sugarcoating it. The F is a bad bingo tile appearing in less than 10% of all seven and eight letter words. A major reason for that poor bingo percentage is that it meshes very poorly with the other high scoring tiles in the set, a trend that continues into shorter words as well. 
Still, the F remains a solid scoring tile thanks to a good array of two-letter words combined with a strong four-point face value. I'm giving the F two stars. If you're a newer player, the ability to form parallels with two-letter words that score in the 20 to 40 point range will quickly endear the F to you as a scoring tile. But as you improve your ability to spot bingos, the F will start to fall behind the three-point tiles in usefulness. Ultimately, the F's biggest problem is that the things that make it unique, including its tendency to appear as the first letter in words and unique tolerance for duplication, just don't add that much value to it as an asset.